Hey, what's going on guys? It is Pet, and today I'm going to be bringing you guys a video. So this isn't going to be like one of the other average videos that you would see on my channel. This one, I'm actually going to be talking about a story that happened uh, during one of my classes. This happened about a week ago, and I just thought I would share it with you guys. So in the background, I'm just going to be playing some Skywars and just some random stuff. And um, yeah, so I'm just going to be talking here. So it was an average day in my life, and I was going to my phys physics class, which was my last class of the day. So I go into the class, I sit down, people sit down all around me, you know, it's average day of class. So we start to take up homework. And one of the questions asked, what would happen if a car suddenly stopped and you were wearing a seatbelt? So the answer to this question was the you would get like propelled forward because of your like speed, velocity, whatever, and the seatbelt would help catch you. So someone in the class decided to put up their hand and ask a question. Now this question, like, I, 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 I can't explain it. So the question was, how do you wear a seatbelt? And you would think that after 16 to 17 years of your life, you would know how to properly wear a seatbelt. So like, I, I thought this was just a joke. And then the person further explained that they, like, they wore it completely wrong. They, like, put their hand through the slot and they did, like, a whole bunch of weird things. And they, it was just like a mess. So, I, I really didn't know how to respond to this. I was just very confused at, like, the first question. And then they started to continue to explain it, and then I just, I, I started to like, melt down. I, I didn't understand anything. So the teacher went on to, like, ask the question of, like, are you being serious? And then the person was like, yes. So I, I facepalmed, of course, and then I started laughing, like, quietly laughing. I sit in the back of the class, so nothing can really... The teacher can't hear you, and like, you know, if you're quiet enough, then no one can hear you. So, I was laughing, and then the teacher decided to show how you probably wear a seatbelt. So what she did was she pulled up this website, and it was like, a how to properly wear a seatbelt website. And there's just four pictures, like, two were, with, two were the wrong ways of wearing it, and two were the right ways, I believe. I think it was four pictures, at least. I'll probably show you guys the the website. I'll put it up uh, on the screen right now. I don't see it in front of me right now, just you guys, so I really don't know what it looks like. But anyways, the the gist is that she explained how to properly wear a seatbelt. But the person was still confused. They thought they were wearing it the right way. So the person asked the class, so who else wears their seatbelt like this? And they were just like, no, no one wears it like this. And we all wear it properly. So everyone in the class was just like, Are you okay? Are you having a bad day? But, like, she she was still convinced. So the teacher then decided to pull up a crash test dummy uh, video where the car crashed into the wall and the dummy was wearing a seatbelt. So it was wearing the seatbelt incorrectly for the first video and then it was wearing it correctly for the second. You can clearly see in the first video that the dummy went flying. And then in the second video, it was like, well, you know, it was like, all right, it was your, I guess, perfect save by the seatbelt. So by this point, I was questioning how I was in a university level physics class. I was questioning how this was like, how this was actually being asked. You would think, after 17 years, 16, 17 years, you would know how to wear a seatbelt, but that's not the case. I guess people don't know how to wear a seatbelt. So just in case you guys don't know how to wear a seatbelt, I'm going to put up a little diagram here of how to properly wear one. So at the end of the day, uh, I put up a tweet that said, spent the last 20 minutes in my physics class talking about how to properly wear a seatbelt, starting to question how this is a university class. And, you know, I, I, I really was questioning how I was in a university class. I thought I was in, like, some of the really low-tier classes in my school. 
But, you know, I, I then started to question, if they don't understand how to wear a seatbelt, then how have they understood anything that has happened in this class? Like, wearing a seatbelt is one of the most basic things, and I... <sighs> okay, move, moving on. So anyways, it was the next day of class, we go to school, we go to the physics class, and my friend and I were just like, ha ha ha, talking about seatbelts. And then, the, one of the questions that we were being asked again, like for homework, of course, of which I didn't do, was talking about an astronaut that went, to, that went into space, and then something along the lines of that. And then I, I told my friend, like, I bet this question is going to turn into another lecture on how to wear a seatbelt properly. So, I, I, was, I was correct. <laughs> I, I was completely correct. Somehow, someone in the class related this question to wearing seatbelts. The teacher started talking about how to properly wear a freaking seatbelt. This is the second day that we were talking about this. The second day that the person did not understand how to wear one. The second day I questioned how I was in this class. This class has probably made me laugh more than learn than like anything. There's been so many other things that have happened in this class that have just been unexplainable and they they don't make any sense. Well considering the whole class doesn't make any sense, physics is like what? But these things just stand out, like how to how to wear a seatbelt. So on the second day uh, of talking about how to wear seatbelts, at the end of the day, I made another tweet. I replied to the last one saying, "Day two of talking about seatbelts. I swear to fucking god, like we were talking about seatbelts again." For this one was probably a bit longer than the first one. Like we 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 discussed the crash tests again. We looked at how to wear the seatbelt website again. And it's things like these that you just question. How 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 they were in this class. How I'm in this class. How I am smarter than them. And how probably a four-year-old is smarter than them. So, anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video on how to wear a seatbelt. I hope you guys know how to wear a seatbelt, or else I'll just flip out on you. Um, yeah, so anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please click that subscribe button and the like button. And I don't know if you guys want more of these. There's a few other stories that I could probably tell. Uh, about this physics class or about like school in general, but um, yeah, so if you guys want any of those any more of these um, Just uh, put a comment down below say that you want one and Yeah, so thanks once again, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye